So hey, welcome back. If you have been following this journey, then you already know that this has been a wild ride. We started with web application development using Bubble for 100 days, and then we explored three no-code automation platforms for 21 days, and for more than 120 days, we explored AI tools. After 243 days, we want to start something more exciting. And if you're new here, I am Ritesh Ekde and I am doing this crazy thousand days of no code challenge where I am posting one new video every single day for thousand days, exploring new tools and systems that can boost productivity both on your personal and business front. And anybody can do this because all of the things that we are exploring is without writing a single line of code. So let me officially welcome you to the phase four of this journey. And this is all about AI agents. Agents sounds like some serious tech, but in reality, what we are going to explore is powerful, but at the same time, very simple. We are talking about systems that can actually work for you instead of just wait for you to give prompt every now and then. And here's what made me do this series. We spoke to our community members, asked them if they were interested in learning this tech, which is trending all over the world. And the answer from all of them was a resounding yes. And that's why we decided we will do this series and help all of you learn how to automate your day-to-day -day activities without writing a single line of code and with the help of AI. So the big question that we are going to answer in this series is, can tools talk to each other? Can it work on its own? That's where automation comes in. And that's where agents comes in. And this space is all about building such flows. Smart little systems that watches for something to happen and then use AI to decide what to do and just do it. You just set it up once and it keeps running in the background. Now, if you're wondering what is automation, then it's very simple. If this happens, then do that. I'll explain in more detail. The first part, when something happens, is basically called a trigger. Let's assume that a user has filled a form on your website. Once the form is submitted, that's called a trigger, right? Now you might want to send them an acknowledgement email stating that you have received the form and that is called an action. So in this example of a user submitting a form and an email being sent to the user, user submitting a form is the trigger and we sending them an email acknowledgement is the action. We will soon look at these examples and you will understand what are triggers and what are actions. Also, just in case if you are hearing the term no code for the first time, then no code means you don't have to write code. We use drag and drop logic where you drag and drop the elements and the system will write the code behind the scenes. So we non-technical persons do not have to worry about code. You don't need to be a developer. You just have to understand the logic like if this, then that. And this isn't the first time we are exploring no code automation. Back in phase two, we did a complete 21 days of no code automation series using platforms like Zapier, Public Connect, and Make. If you haven't watched that, and if you are interested in knowing more about automation, do watch that series. And in this series, we are going to explore most trending tool right now, that is N8N. N8N is very different from these tools because N8N has AI agents built in. So we don't have to build a lot of logics. 
which are already available. You just drag and drop those agents, tell it what needs to be done and it does the job for you. We will explore this one by one. I know all of you are excited to begin this journey, but we will start our first automation tomorrow. For today, we will just create our account and keep everything ready so that we can start from tomorrow. So let's create our accounts and get ready. So to begin, head over to na10.io and click on get started. So it's asking us for the full name and we have to use company email here. Do get some company email address and use it here. Um, so I am going to use abcdheartwit7.com and I'm going to generate the password using password manager. Uh, account name abcdheart7 and I'll click on start free 14 day trial. It's going to ask us a few questions. Um, I'm going to select some random things. Of course, you can read through it and uh, answer them. Uh, YouTube. And have you contracted an external agency to help build your workflows? Nope, because we want to learn and build it ourselves. And uh, it'll allow you to invite your team members, but I'll skip it for now. And everything is ready. I'll click on start automating and that's it. So once we do that, we can see the dashboard overview basically. Production uh, executions is zero, failed production execution is zero, failure rate is zero, time saved in the last seven days is zero of course, it is empty. Runtime average is also zero seconds. So this is the dashboard and uh, this is where uh, we can see all the workflows and all of that which we are going to explore tomorrow. So create your account on NA10 and be ready to create your first automation tomorrow. So yeah, it's a fresh challenge that we have started. No more exploring multiple tools. It's just one tool for the next few weeks that is going to connect multiple other tools and get things done automatically. Before I let you go, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please do because we are going to come up with videos that will save you a lot of time and share it with your friends, family and colleagues. See you in the next one. I hope you are ready.